Uh, my name is Jason Hurd. I'm the executive director for the Vancouver International Auto Show, uh, our 96th year. Uh, looking forward to a huge show this year. What we did is we've uh, activated the outside space a lot better. So we've added about 50 additional cars that you'll see on the outdoor space. Uh, one is through the NOS Energy Dub Show Tour. This is the first ever Canadian stop. And uh, the NOS Tour, it brings uh, big wheels, jacked up trucks, uh, super special, highly modified vehicles. So it's gonna be a lot of fun. And we have drive ups every day that have 20 to 25 cars in them. So it's different every day. And uh, we invite people to come up and, and check it out outside. And we know we'll draw them inside from that. Vancouver is very unique. Uh, any market across Canada, any market really in North America, we have these really different and uh, opposite almost uh, uh, interests, you could almost say. Uh, we are the super car per capita uh, leaders in North America. So Vancouver, little Vancouver here, supercar capita North America. We also have more charging stations for green vehicles than anywhere else in Canada per capita. Oh uh, yeah, we have a number of standout cars at the show this year. Uh, we have uh, one North American reveal. Uh, we have a, a few uh, Canadian reveals and a whole bunch of uh, market, but my favorite cars uh, right now, we have um, Lexus is bringing us two concept cars. One is called the LFC2, it's a convertible it is the most amazing gold color you've ever seen. It's absolutely gorgeous. They've also brought us their GT3 car, uh, so lots of fun. Never seen, neither car has ever been to this market before. Well, it, it, it's neat. Yesterday I was holding the keys to a LaFerrari and the MC12, and that in, in my hand was 7.5 million US. So the other cool thing about it is, like you're, you're talking about a different world, right? Uh, we have two LaFerraris at the show this year, and we don't think any auto show in North America has ever had that. So again, it speaks to our market and the, and the uniqueness and diversity of it. But uh, you know, we're talking some big money on some of these cars, and uh, you know, that's that's the dream. But you get to see the stuff that you get to buy too, and and that's that's the exciting thing. Uh, you know, as, as amazing as the Enzo is, I'm sure it doesn't have navigation, right? So.